set me an alarm. But for 10 minutes, but it's been like four minutes, so I gotta go to work. But at the same time, y'all, I'm getting in that vibe again. And I'm just gonna try to pull myself up out of it because I need to stop acting crazy because you know YouTube ain't anyway. Y'all I gotta I'm trying, I'm fucking trying, and I be venting because I be needing somebody to talk to too, and I don't got nobody. Uh, we know people they in it for themselves. So I, when I say I don't got nobody, I don't got nobody. And I vent to y'all my subscribers because the ones that still watch me for the good reason, with thumbs up in me and leaving me the positive comments, I know y'all got me as far as like the support wise, the moral support, right? The support from across the way, the technology, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? It'd be the people that be in your face and acting like they got, they don't fuck with you. They be in it for themselves. We know this, okay? So that's the reason why I, I really don't, y'all think it's a joke. I don't got friends. I don't got no lover. If I did, y'all would know. <laughs> y'all would know. Y'all probably won't see his face unless we agree to, like, you know, do that, go public. But y'all would know if I got a man, because I don't give a fuck. I got a man. <laughs> but anyway, I'm getting in that vibe, y'all, and I'm trying to shake that shit up off of me because. When I get fully in it, it get hard to pull myself up out of it. I've been falling in it for a month now. Anyway. So I want to pull three of these. I don't know. They didn't show me too much shit. Fuck that shit. Let me... That's what they didn't show me overall. Somebody is pure evil. Somebody is just pure motherfucking evil. I don't give a fuck what they they pure evil. Or somebody is they could be saying this about you. Or this is how people could be thinking of you. Caught busted. They chose the wrong enemy. I infatuated with you. Yeah, somebody anybody <laughs> get but Child, what is going on? What y'all doing out here in these streets? Your up level talking out more. Y'all, you dealing with a snake? Healer? Come on now. We got pure evil and then we got the complete opposite. We got a healer and then we got the complete opposite. Y'all get the fuck what's going on. Y'all get what was going on. We dealing with a healer, but they say you was pure evil. Even the disciples had to go to war, get down ugly, get dirty. It had to be some type of... Okay, anyway... Whoever you are, though, you a healer. And ain't no denying that. There's no denying that. You help people feel good, feel secure. You help people get out of those wounds, that trauma. Okay, you help people see the brighter side of things. You help people to see a positive outlook in a situation when they feel like there is no positive outlook. Okay, and you yourself possibly be going through it just like me. All while you going through it, you're still uplifting other people. But you feeling like shit inside. And they calling you pure evil. We already know why they calling you pure evil, though. They some hating, jealous ass bitches. Because they really evil. It's fuck. And they scared that you trying to expose them. When you don't give a fuck about what it is that they doing. Because everybody got the past. You don't give a fuck about them. They so worried about you. That's the thing. You don't give a fuck about them, but they so worried about you. That's where they fucked up at. Being so fucking infatuated with you. Oh fuck. I'm tired of people. I'm gonna fuck. I'm tired of people. I wish I can sit up and do readings all day, but it doesn't benefit me. <laughs> you don't benefit me no more. They don't wanna see you guys together. 
I did this my last reading. For some of you guys, you got a jealous bitch and she's married or with someone. Or this is an ex of somebody. He's like, you were meant to be with somebody. Now, hold on, y'all. There's some opposites of attraction. You might be the healer dealing with a... I don't know what this person do. Don't. <laughs> yeah. I don't judge. Because I know opposites attract. Seeing it, believing. I know opposites attract. For some of you guys, this person was sent to do some evil shit to you and they fell in love with your eyes. Thugs need love too, thug passion. <laughs> they hate me. Why though? Because I'm real? I don't give a fuck. Like, what's going on? Before I pick this deck up. It ain't no concern. Somebody don't want you being concerned no more over these family secrets. They said they rated. <laughs> I don't know why it's just there. Somebody rated. Look. If this motherfucker tell you he ready to go to war for you, let me stop being so loud. But I didn't got see this is serious. This person told you he ready to go to war for you. He will lay somebody ass out flat for you. He mean that shit. He mean that shit. It's somebody dealing with some family secrets. There's something going on in the family dynamic. All right, I gotta make sure I ain't flashing nobody. <laughs> it's something going on with family dynamic, and you don't even know half of the shit that you're going through is coming from your family. Okay, sad to say, it is, and it's fucked up. Y'all, my fucking alarm went off, but I'm gonna make this a exception. Oh, fuck it, I gotta get, I gotta go though. But uh, it's somebody in your family that's been the host of this war. They've been, they've been one of the main people conducting this shit. And somebody ready to go to war for you, cause they see it's your family putting you through this tri this trial, this this riot, this battle that you going through, whether it's spiritually, emotionally, physically. Your family is the one that's putting you through it, or somebody that you once had a family with, it could be like a baby mama or baby daddy. Or someone in your, it don't got to be like your whole family, but it could be some people, like a brother, a sibling, uh, a parent, cousin, grandparent, aunt, uncle, excuse me. I birthed on aunt and uncle, goddamn. There's somebody ready to go to war for you. And I feel like this person already told you. That if they got to do, they, if they got to go, if they got to get their hands dirty, they're going to get their hands dirty for you. Because somebody not playing fair. Somebody not playing fair. But yet, this is one of these people out there crying wolf. They out here crying motherfucking wolf. For, like, what the fuck you playing? This is playing victim. They playing victim. Because they want you to be their sacrifice. Okay? He's one of them type bitches. They need to get slapped. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I need to slap some motherfucking sense into their ass, though. What is this? What is this for? And it's all because they don't want to see you with someone. They could have sent that person. My, uh, I did a reading like this already. They sent this person to fuck your life over. But this person is like, hell no, nah, I fuck with this person. <laughs> they fuck with you. I don't know why, but I fuck with you, shoddy. Okay, somebody might use the word shoddy. They like, I fuck with shoddy. I don't know where that fuck that shit just came from. Why did you be from like down south? And y'all know them down south, man. They treat they women different. They really about that, what is it called? Like that southern hospitality? Oh, yeah, they take care of they motherfucking people. Somebody not protected. Or somebody wants you to let your guard down. Like they try to break that fucking boundary that you, you got to, whoever you are, you very guarded because you, you scared. You scared. You done went through a lot. And for some of you guys, you know exactly where the hurt and the, the the betrayal is coming from. So for you, it's your family. So if you 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 in this mood, like, well, if I know my family did it, and 
that's who I put my loyalty, my trust into. I fuck with them heavy. Them, you know, I love them. I'm going to go to war for them. If my family did it to me, like, ain't no telling what an outsider is going to do to me. So that's why you got your guard up. But somebody wants you to let your guard down. And that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Like, the truth is going to come out. And I feel like the truth is that they protecting you. Okay? They got you. The, tr the chariot. The chariot is also saying, back to this battle, this riot. Didn't I say this riot, this battle? Look it up. You will have victory and success over this battle, this riot, this fight. Whatever this is, you will be able to triumph over it. Like, you will get through it, okay? This may even be dealing with, like, travel, relocation, um, a car, Could be a cancer involved, but the truth is gonna come out. Cause somebody not with that bullshit. They ain't with that bullshit. They wanna protect you. They wanna they they fuck with you the long way, shoddy. I don't know where the fuck that's going. But somebody gonna know what the fuck I'm talking about. They fuck with you the long way, shoddy. Hey, you may even be calling this person your shoddy. I don't fucking know. But somebody fuck with you the long way. Okay, Pee Wee Long, Pee Wee Long Way. Let me find. <laughs> Do y'all listen to him? I listen to him. Hello. <laughs> I don't like saying rappers' names. Be like, I don't know why I just heard Pee Wee Long Way. <laughs> but I'm sorry. Anyway, but somebody is ready to make some type of change, a quick change. Not in the pinnacle. I listened to him back in the day. I ain't listened to him. Like, I don't know if he ain't got no new music, nothing like that. I don't know where he from, though. Yeah, this is, I, I'm so, ooh. <laughs> Somebody might listen to him a lot. Okay, this person may listen to him a lot. That's how you may know. With this, if this is your reading, because he may listen to, I feel like this man listened to him. You, the female, you may listen to him a lot. Because I know I found out about him through my, um, a, a boy. I did. A lot of the artists I listen to, though, I did not find out from no guy. I found them on my own or my kid. And then it's a, it's a other half percentage I did find out from my brothers. I think my baby daddy listened to people long way. No, he did not. But anyway, they've been, somebody been trying to fuck with you. They've been trying to keep you out of a relationship, trying to keep you single. But it's like you being single for as long as you did it, in your, it worked in your favor because somebody sees while you was being single, you was upright, nine of pentacles, financially independent. You knew your worth. You wasn't selling for nothing. You'll play with you before you play with these. Okay. They seen that, and they fucked with that heavy, so it worked in your favor. I don't got time. Seven of Pentacles. So this person waiting. They want to give you this offer. Nine of Pentacles. Who is this King of Pentacles? I only got time for this past person. All right, I said what I said. We're going to leave it at that because it's a deeper message, but I ain't about to go there because they're going to go to war for you, shawty. Because <laughs> they see for a fact this motherfucker a hater, son. They ain't with that shit. Like, that's not cool. Whatever they did, it's not cool. Somebody went over and beyond, out the way. So they looking at them too, like, if you will do all of this because you don't want to see me and shawty together. <laughs> Ain't no telling what the fuck you really would do. Like, I don't trust you either. So they, they could have thought that they were winning the trust of this person. But in actuality, it made this person put up a guard too. Like, I got to watch y'all motherfuckers too. I see y'all motherfuckers is not to be trusted. Y'all do anything and everything for a client that part. What would you do for a client that part? Okay, here we go. I want to do readings today, but I can't. Damn, that's fucked up. Blackmail. God damn. So they've been trying to blackmail your ass. Judgment being called down. Now somebody having irrational. So okay, whoa! Somebody could even be thinking about so, what? Should, what the hell do you want? Yes, I thought you already did that when you told me the whole little speech about putting it in the freezer and making it. Yeah, go go do it. Yeah. I, yeah.
You lighten up the energy though, because uh, this person could be trying to figure out what they want to do with themselves now because it, whatever they even did did not work. And they looking like the when you assume you make an ass out of me and you, they were trying to make an ass out of you, but they made an ass out of themselves too. They made an ass out of themselves too. So, I gotta get in the shower and I gotta go. He said, a win is a win. Okay, because some y'all, you might be hurt and you might be devastated, but it's like it's going to be in your best interest because you don't even know what the fuck was going on behind closed doors with this person. Ciao. Okay, and that's all I want to say because it's for sure going to be some type of ending. And it might be by, um, what is it called? Okay, now I just heard. Ooh, I don't even know the name, but you know when people call the police? Okay. Okay. Because I wanted to say su suicide, y'all, but I didn't want to say it. Suicide ways, boys in the day. And somebody really could be from, like, down south, though. But anyway, you know when, like, somebody, like, point the gun on the police purposely to so that the police can shoot them type shit? But I forgot what it's called. Something of that nature because somebody just don't want to see you. What they, I don't know what's up with these people or this person. I don't know what this is, y'all. Oh, I want to go deeper. Well, I don't know. Well, I'm gonna just leave it at that, y'all, because she's just telling me some shit about. Ugh, I don't care. Anyway, I love you guys so much. Take care. And just know that there's going to be an ending. And back again, this person, they chose the wrong enemy. You didn't know that this person's been an enemy of yours. Whoever you are, you all love and light, but they ain't love. You You so love and light, you think other people is love and light, and they pure motherfucking evil, child. <laughs> they be saying that these type of people that be like, oh, you so of light, smiling in your face. We about to kill this bitch. We about to set this bitch up. We about to spit in their food. We about to do this and that. Like, it's really people out there like this, y'all. It, it's so, they're just really evil. Like, why would you do that? It's just no reason for them to do it, but they just do it. Just be, there's really people walking around with no emotions, no feelings, no heart. And we go, man, and it'd be like, that's not funny, but they think it's funny. They think it's cool. And it's, yeah, somebody did that. You don't even know. This person really, for sure, is evil. And they think they have a, of the dark. They think it's cool. And they think they just, some, a lot of people just don't know themselves. That'd be the fucked up part. But it's okay because they chose that path. I'm just saying, you don't. I used to always try to wonder why, but it ain't for you to wonder why. That's what you decided to do. Like, especially when you get grown after a while. You grown, grown? Well, you chose the path that you wanted to go down. Whoever this is, do they grown? They have more than enough, like, you know, to reevaluate. That's what you really, you really want to do that. I guess they feel like that was their crowd of people. Because somebody, uh-uh. Well, anyway. Y'all. I love y'all so much again. Take care. You're going to be all right. But just know your enemy. They better lay low. <laughs> because if they don't, you really got somebody that's about to take their ass out. And then, like, they may not even be taking them out, but they may be having, like, they may be calling the shots. This wealthy man, this great fortune. They got money to do it. Anyway, I'll let y'all so much take care again.